all fair great. How are you today? I hope you are happy. I'm fine. Well, today is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Tuesday. or Sunday. Tuesday, October, November, of or August. 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 And what's the weather like today? It's sunny and hot. Sunny and hot and windy. And windy. Yes. Okay. Tenés que ir mirando, por favor, open your file, vas a ir abriendo todos los files que te vamos mandando, ¿sí? Lo que te vamos a mandar en breve va a ser el tema de Popstar, el que hiciste, los cuadro, el cuadrito que tenía estaba dividido en cuatro, la hoja dividida en cuatro, te van a ir llegando las correcciones. Es importantísimo que cada uno mire sus correcciones. ¿Es clear? Yes. So, first of all, we are going to check pages 93 and 103, 109. From the cuadernillo, yes? Okay? If it is okay, put a tick. If it is wrong, put a cross, okay? Is it clear? 93. And then we are going to repeat. Acordate que tenés que hacer las repeticiones, okay? Tenés que hacer las repeticiones de la lista. Entonces, la mejor idea... Es, así como hizo aquí, yes. poner todos los verbitos, yes, ok, verbos, y ir a verbos 2 por, por tanda de 10 en 10, y ir haciendo la repetition, yes, ok, right, de toda la lista hasta verbs 7, Toda la lista, ¿sí? Con buena letra, por supuesto. Yes, of course. Yes. Entonces tenés toda. Y si te cansas, te vas a jugar un rato y después volvés a hacer. Que no se te encime todo el trabajo. Porque no es lo mismo ir haciendo de 10 en 10 que hacer toda la lista. No te levantás más, se te queda la cola aplastada. ¿Y se clear? Yes, ok. Bueno, entonces hay que ser consciente de ese trabajo. 93, ok. Completar con was o where. ¿Qué significa was o where? Estuvo. Yes, ok. Usamos was para... Pasado. Pasado de las personas. He, she, or it. He, she, or it. And uh, where para... You. We. We, they. They. Yes, yo dije I no, eh. I was. Ok. Good. Vamos, put a tick or a cross. With an extra color. Susan and Molly... Cuadernillo, page 93. Susan and Molly, where? Yes. Peter, was. Yes, put a chico across. Yes, okay, good. Susan and Molly, where? Peter, what? Susana Jiménez, wasn't. Wasn't, porque dice negativo. They, were. My parents, were. My friends, were. It, was. The dog, was. My family, where? my mom and dad, where? my parents, where? weren't. Teacher Ruth, What? atención ahí, tenemos que corregir ese Teacher Ruth que se nos pasó la letra ahí, ¿eh? Está dado vuelta, ¿eh? R-U-T-H, corrijan por favor. Number 13, she, What? Uh, 14, I was. was and Sandra was. was. And then complete the paragraph. Atención, este paragraph solo es para completar con was o wasn't, was o weren't. Entonces, ¿qué es lo importante de uh, was o were? Saber con qué van las tres, ¿ok? Los dos. We, he, she, and it. And where? We, you, they. Esto sería lo básico de cero estar. Está, ya lo tenemos del año pasado. This year is revision. Yes? Yesterday, our class one. Where? Our class was. Porque es la clase. Yes? Was. Yes? Corrijo si puse where. Ah, yo pensé que se trataba de los años. No, no es plural. Yes? Students. Si hubiese dicho students, sí, pero dice la clase. Yes, number two, it was. was. Number three, we we were our things. Number four, 
our things, nuestras cosas. Where. Where. Ok. Number five. Where. Where. Number six. Where. Where. Porque dice pupils, teachers. Where. Eight. Buses. Where. Where. We. Where. We. Where. The weather. Where. Was. It. Where. Was. It. Where. Was. Very interesting. We. Where. Where. Okay. Uh, it. Was. Was. Okay. Well, number one, false. Number two, true. Number three, true. Number four, true. Number five, false. And now page 109. Yes, 109. Attention, please. Okay. Atención. Pay attention. Acá tenemos uh, verbos regular and irregular. Pero, ¿cómo sé, teacher, cuál es uno y cuál es otro? Porque te tenés que saber la lista. Si no, le vas a querer agregar cualquier cosa al verbo. Entonces, tenés que saber cuáles son los regulares, los cuales le agregamos E, D. Y los irregulares, los que cambian la segunda columna, go, went. ¿Ok? Well, ok, number one. You repeat. Corregimos y repetimos, ¿eh? Ask, asked. Asked. Repeat. Asked. Asked. No tenemos que decir asked. Yeah. Okay. Asked. Asked. Yes. Okay. Number two. Walked. Walked. Studied. Study. Ojo con studied. Be careful because study is like this. And in Y, tacho la Y and E, E, D. Studied. Okay. Yes. Sleep. Sleep. Left, leave, left. Repetition, leave, left. left. Repetition, leave, left. Left. Leave, left. The two, darling, the two. Leave, left. Okay. Can, could. Can, could. Stay, stayed. Stay, stayed. Climb, climbed. Climb, climbed. Taste, tasted. Taste, tasted. Change, changed. Change, changed. Entonces, en pasado van a sonar con una T, o a veces con D, o a veces con ED. ¿Ok? Wake up. Atención acá, hay un irregular. Wake up, woke up. Wake up, woke up. Repetition. Wake up, woke up. Come. Come. Came. Came. Meet, met. Meet, met. Bring, brought. Bring, brought. Swim, swam. Swim, swam. Begin, began. Begin, began. Teach, taught. Teach, taught. Si no sabes la lista, vas a querer poner teach, teacher. Entonces, eso va a mostrar que no hay dominio de la lista de verbo. Si no tengo dominio de la lista de verbo, no puedo expresarme en pasado. Por ejemplo, ¿es claro? Yes. Skate, skate. Skate, skate. Put up, put up. Put up. En el caso de put queda put put. Las dos columnas son iguales, el infinitive y el pasado. Watch, watched, watch, watch, explore, explored, explored, explored. La, loved, loved, loved. Listen, listened, listen, listened. Visit, visited, visit, visit. ¿Ves? Te das cuenta, ahí está, visited. Yes, ok. Do, did. Do, did. Ok. De 25 verbos tenés que sacarte cuánto hiciste bien. Ok. Well, this is done. So pay attention now. Lista de verbo mano. I want you to have the list of verb. List of verb. Yes. Okay. Sit down there. Yes. Okay. Come on, darling. Come on. Are you ready? Lista de verbo mano. Y este video te tiene que quedar para que vos estudies con esta repetición que vamos a hacer de toda la lista. Yes. Is it clear? Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Good. Ready, steady, go. No proyecto para que se vea mejor. Por eso me voy a poner aquí de pie para cerca de la cámara. Vos seguís tu lista. You follow in your list. ¿Ok? Live, lift. Live, lift. Play, plate. Play, plate. Like, liked. Like, like. Visit, visited. Visit, visited. Clean, clean. Clean, cleaned. Clean, cleaned. Cook, cooked. Cook, cooked. 
After the sound, después del sonido, así da tiempo, ¿ok? Is it clear? Yes. Love, loved. Love, loved. Explore, explored. Explore, explored. Travel, traveled. Travel, traveled. Open, opened. Open, opened. Help, helped. Help, helped. Switch on, switched on. Switch off, switched off. Switch off, switched off. Start, started. Start, started. Listen, listened. Listen, listened. Watch, watched. Watch, watched. 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 Chat, chatted. Chat, chatted. Study, studied. Study, studied. Study. Press, pressed. Arrive in, arrived, arrived. Okay. Uh, escape, escaped. Escape, escaped. Put up, put up. Put up, put up. Walk, walked. Walk, walked. Move, moved. Move, moved. Want, wanted. Want, wanted. Jump, jumped. Jump, jumped. Jump, jumped. Jump. Jumped. Kick, kicked. Kick, kicked. Call, called. Call, called. Hit, hit. Hit, hit. Y atención, porque ahí hit no va. Hit iría, táchenlo por favor, en irregulares. Yes, ok, sáquenlo de ahí. Sí, se nos escapó ese hit. Ok, yes. Vamos a 6, 7 and 8. Dale, que terminamos. Come on. Stop, stopped. Follow, followed. Follow, followed. Believe, believed. Believe, believed. Collect, collected. Collect, collected. Climb, climbed. Climb, climbed. Stay, stayed. Stay, stayed. Arrive, vos tenés, arrive in, arriba, que es a un país, arrive in, y arrive at, cuando son lugares, por ejemplo, arrive at the station, arrive at the cinema, yes, ok. Eh, invite, invited. Invite, invited. Use, used. Use, used. Decide, decided. Decide, decided. Mix, mixed. Mix, mixed. Taste, tasted. Taste, tasted. Change, changed. Marry, married. Marry, marry. Look for, looked for. Look for, looked for. Irregulars. Poner hit ahí, por favor. Yes. Okay, pay attention. Okay, good. Ready? Go went. Go went. Go shopping went shopping. Go shopping went shopping. Go fishing went fishing. Go fishing went fishing. Make made. Make made. Send sent. Send sent. Sell sold. Sell sold. Sit sat. Sit sat. Feel felt. Have had. Have had. Sing sang. Sing sang. Speak spoke. Speak spoke. Do did. Do did. See saw. See saw. Sleep slept. Sleep slept. Drink drunk. Drink drunk. Buy bought. Buy bought. Can could. Leave left. Leave left. Give gave. Give gave. Win won. Win won. Teach taught. Teach taught. Begin began. Begin began. Become became. Become became. Bueno, y ahí ese verbo es súper fácil porque vos podés ya saberlo desde come came, desde de venir, ¿está? Yes. Go away también went. 
Fly flu. Fly flu. Swim swam. Fall fell. Feel felt. Ok. Feel ya está arriba también, ¿eh? así que ya si lo estudias está arriba, ya está. No new. Think thought. Draw drew. Where are war? Choose chose. Meet met. Come came. Come came. Come back came back. Bring brought. Catch caught. Wake up woke up. Wake up. Entonces, cada vez que tengas que repetir los verbos, vas a ir a este vídeo del de 25, martes 25 de agosto, y vas a poner play y vas a repetir con, porque está toda pronunciada la, uh, the list of verbs. ¿Es it clear? Well, now very quickly, we're going to go to, yes, primero, acordate que en las últimas páginas de Communication Activities, en las que estamos trabajando, primero trabajamos la parte oral, luego la escrita. Orally and written. Orally and written. Yes? It means that you are going to practice, que vas a practicar. En el caso de la clase de hoy, vamos a revisar de nuevo la Unit 5 y la Unit 6. O sea que esta es, una, esta es una de las primeras oportunidades que tenés de revisar todo. En la clase pasada, revisamos las unidades 3 y 4. Y en la clase antepasada, las unit 1 and 2. Entonces, muy, muy importante que estés viendo los vídeos que no te pierdas. ¿Ok? Porque estamos revisando de nuevo todas las units desde la unit 1. Después también se va en la otra instancia del periodo de esquematización. También vamos a revisar todo de nuevo con el cuadernillo. ¿Es clear? ¿Yes? Ok. So, pay attention now. Ok. Can you dictate me some uh, birds? Yes. Yo voy a ir diciendo y me van a ir dictando en casa. Vos tenés que decir desde casa. Yes? Is it clear? Uh, first of all, I want you to dictate me yes, some adverbs. Ok? Adverbs. El primero, verbos. Ok? Good. Uh, patear. Kick. Kick. Coser. Serve. Serve. Um, Saltar la cuerda. Kick the... Kick the... Skip the... Road. Road. Ir a navegar. Go sailing. Go sailing. Ok. Good. Uh, hacer, ir a hacer windsurfing. Go windsurfing. Windsurfing. Go windsurfing. Yes, okay. Um, what else? Do, 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 do. Construir un robot. Build a robot. Build a robot. Okay, build a robot. Uh, jugar al ajedrez. Play chess. Play chess. Okay. Con estos verbos me conformo. Verbs, son verbs de la unit, from unit 5, yeah? Y ahora necesito, on the other side, adverbs, adverbios. Comienzo con uno. Well, ay Dios, oh my God. Well, well, adverbs, adverbs. Ok, well, rápidamente, um, quickly, quickly. Yes, ok. Uh, lentamente. Um, slowly. Slowly. Um, tranquilamente. Quietly. Quietly. Oops. Quietly. Uh, fuerte. Loudly. Loudly. Uh, the other one. No me quiero olvidar. Eh, cuidadosamente. Carefully. Carefully. Care, be careful. Eh, tener cuidado. Yes, ok. 
carefully. Entonces tenemos, are you ready to repeat? Vamos a repetir. Ok. Kick, kick, two, eh, perdón. Kick, kick, so, two, skip the road, skip the road, go sailing, go sailing, go in surfing, go in surfing, build a robot, build a robot, play chess, play chess, adverse, repetition. Ok. Well, well, quickly, quickly, slowly, slowly, Quietly, quietly, loudly, loudly, carefully, carefully. Okay, well done. So pay attention now. I'm going to project something. Yeah. And we're going to work. Prepara el cuaderno, por favor. Tu cuaderno de inglés. Yes, your notebook. Pay attention, pay attention. Yes, put the dates. Tuesday, the 25th of Bla, 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 with the date. Yes, ok. A ver, mientras que proyecta. Ah, no, no, no. Yes, wait a minute. So, about, uh, we have Mindy, yes, okay, can you see from there? Good. Yes or no? Yes. Yes, es la misma foto, por si no podés ver bien de ahí, que tenemos en el activity en la página 125, 125. Yes, ok. Is it clear? 125. Ok. Well, right. Good. So it says about Mindy. And these are the activities. Mindy, we are going to do can. Yes, we are going to use can plus. A bird plus an adverb. Yes or no? Yes. Yes, okay. Good, an adverb. So this is, ah, oh, yes. This is the structure. Yes, okay. Se me revelan los markers también. Okay, good. There we are. Okay. Aldana, Mindy. Mindy. Miramos la picture. Mindy is going to surf. No. Can, verbo, adverbio. Ah. No estamos en el futuro. Mindy can. Mindy can. Surf. Surf. Easily. Easily. Now it's okay. Pongo así con colores. Eh? Ok. She, otra. She, she, puede construir algo, inventa. She can build, she can build, a castle, a castle, well done, a well. castle, well, ok, ojo que se me juntó ahí, well, ok, and the last one, pay attention, Mindy, can, can climb, climb a tree a tree badly okay not badly no se le ve que está tan mal yes para mí que está lenta que le ven okay slowly yes slowly quietly 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 tranquilamente bueno okay Entonces, ¿qué es lo que practicamos aquí en esta actividad 
on page 125, we practice can, el uso del can, más el verbo, más un adverbio. ¿Ok? ¿Es it clear? Yes. Complete, please. Completo mi libro, rapidito. Y vamos a ir a Mickey. Yes, ok. Mm. Aldana, can you tell me? Vas a completar esto y vas a agregar dos frases más privadas. Por ejemplo, I can uh, swim uh, slowly. I can skip the road, the road easily. Alana, two sentences. Um, I can so, so easily. easily. I can write well, very okay, well. Very well. Good. I can do. I can do mathematics slowly. No. Um, Badly. Badly, ok, well. So, write your sentences. Primero completo las que tengo en el libro. Y escribo mis dos frases, ok? Is it clear? Yes. No tienen que copiar las frases. Tienen que escribir ustedes acá, en el cuadrito que tienen en la página 125. O sea que la página 125 también va a llevar fecha. Yes. Estas frases. Can you easily? Uh, me, she can build a castle well. She can climb a tree quietly. Yes, okay, is it clear? And then we're going to go to Mickey. Yes. Good. Ay, se me corre la frase si corro esto, okay? Good. Mickey. Good, good, good. There we are. Ok, about Mickey. Aldana, Mickey can sing la 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 la. Loudly. Loudly. Vamos a poner ese adverbio con rojo. Loudly. He can play computer games. Hmm. Fácilmente. How do you say fácilmente? Um, easily. Easily. He can play computer games easily. He can dance. He can dance. Slowly, well, he can Quietly. dance. Quietly. Quietly, tranquilamente. Ok, good. ¿Está? Entonces te quedan todos los adverbios y que practicamos aquí. I can. Ok, voy a hacer dos más. Yes, ok, two more. Yes, ok, here. Ahora sí, esto sí, in your notebook. Dos frases en tu cuaderno. Tienes que tener a la par tu cuaderno abierto y el libro. Ok, my mother, my mother can read book, read Uh, books. Acordate que después del can, el verbo va en infinitivo. Yes, is it clear? Good. So, my mother can, uh, my father can swim uh, easily. My mother can read, uh, can, perdón, my mother can read books, yes, easily. My daughter can write uh, compositions easily. My mother? Your mother? My mother can teach very well. Okay, thank you. Number two. My sister? My sister can, can, uh, can paint a picture very well. My sister can color the pictures very well. Yes, okay. Good. Entonces, a partir, primero completamos esto. You complete this from page one. Can you uh, continue writing, please? Oh, 125, las dos de Mickey y Mindy. Yes, y después te haces dos frases sobre vos. I can swim easily. I can dance, yes, quietly. I can dance very well. Yes, ok. Pilar, Pilar's mother can dance folklore very well. Me dijo pajarito. Yes, ok. A bird told me. Yes, ok. Entonces hacemos dos tuyas, two. About you, I can, mm -mm, easily. Podemos usar easily, loudly, uh, quickly, quietly, well. Y después una de my mother, my father. Y si tenés un brother o sister, agregar también, ¿ok? Que puede hacer bien, mal, yes, rápidamente. Yes, I can draw carefully. I can paint carefully. Entonces, acá nada de agregarle S ni nada. Verbo can. El can es un verbo modal y siempre 
va a ver, va después del can, va un verbo infinitivo. Listo, bye bye, can. Ok. Y ahora me voy a otro cuadro, que vamos, donde, el cual vamos a practicar la unit 6. ¿Sí? Se practica la unit 6. ¿Y qué vamos a practicar ahí? Was or where. ¿Ok? Que te quede el cuadrito del can ahí en tu cuaderno. ¿Yes? Aldana, please, vamos a poner can más verbo más adverbio. El, al lado de las frases que escribimos. Y aquí vamos a poner quietly, quickly, yes, well, ¿qué más? Uh, carefully, yes, ok, easily. ¿Está? Entonces, bien grande este cuadro y le ponemos unit 5. ¿Sí? que se practicó la unit 5 con este cuadro y con esta gramática. ¿Es it clear? Yes? Yes. All right. Good. Yes. All right. Ok, well, can I clean the ball? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Good, porque vos puedes poner pausa en tu video, ok? Good. So, we have, now we go to the practice of unit 6. Uh, ¿Qué vamos a practicar aquí? Where was Ethan? Where was uh, Ahmed? Yes. Where was Ethan? Where was Ahmed? Pero vamos a poner diferentes cosas. At, más la hora. Y un adverbio. ¿Yes? Yes. Ok. ¿Are you ready, Aldana? First of all, acordate que hacemos question and answer. Question and answer. Y después vamos a lo escrito. ¿Ok? Vamos a usar este cuadro, por supuesto. Ok. Aldana, ¿are you ready? Where was eaten at 10 o'clock uh, yesterday? yesterday? Y atención. Pa, 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 pa. ¿Qué me tengo que acordar cuando me salen estos lugares? Todas las que van con at. At home y at school. Repetition. At home, at school. At the shopping center. Shopping center. Park. Car park. ¿Qué es un car park? Un estacionamiento. Miento. At the train station. No. Yes, at the bus stop. Ok, a de fiesta. Yes, ok. A Granny's House. Yes. A de Park. Ok, ready? Steady, go. Adana, where was Ethan at? Acordate. Where was Ethan o Hamed? En este caso son dos varones, puedo decir también. A tal hora las. Uh, last Saturday, three years ago, o yesterday. Esos son los adverbios, ¿sí? Por eso dice más adverbio ahí, en el cuadro, ¿ok? Is it clear? Ready, steady, go. When was eaten at 10 o'clock yesterday? He, sorry, he, he, where, where was eaten, eaten at 10 o'clock Yesterday, he was at clothes shop. At the clothes. At the club. Ok, entonces tenemos he o she was at, pa, 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 o at the. Dale. Good. Question, Alana. Ahora no hay que escribir nada. Orally first. Come on. Your question. Um, Vos te toca a Ahmed. Dale. Where was Ahmed? Where was Ahmed at 10 o'clock yesterday? At 10 o'clock yesterday? I don't know. It doesn't say. Um, um, where was Ahmed at 3 o'clock three days ago? Uh, Ahmed, or oh, he was at Granny's house. Where was Ethan at 7 o'clock uh, yesterday? He was at the... T 
Theater. 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 Yeah? Okay. Ahmed, your question, where was? Where was Ahmed at 3 o'clock? Three days ago. Three days atrás, eh? Okay, three days ago. Ahmed was at, uh, ya dije, at Granny's house. At 10 o'clock? Where was he at 10 o'clock? Yes. Okay, he was at the bus stop. Yes, three days ago. He was at the bus stop at, three, at 10 o'clock, three days ago. Where was, attention, attention, where was Ethan at 10 o'clock last Saturday? Last Saturday. He was at the train station. Okay. Where was? Where was Ethan? No, Ahmed. Is it Tujo Ahmed? Where was Ahmed um, at 3 o'clock last Saturday? He was at the car park. Where was Ethan at 7 o'clock yesterday? He was at the theater. Another question, Aldana? Ah, oh, this one. Okay, where? Where was... A mess? A mess. Um, at 3 o'clock last Saturday. He was at the park. Okay? Entonces, ¿qué practicamos con este cuadro? Tenés que hacer todas las frases. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 de Ethan. Question and answer. And 5... De Ahmed, Ahmed, yes, ok, 1, 2, 3, 4, eh? tiene 4 nomás, ¿está? Entonces, ¿cuál va a ser la pregunta? Ay, me agarré un... Eh? Ok, where was Ahmed or Ethan at 10 o'clock? ¿Cuáles son los adverbios? Last Saturday, ¿qué Last más tiene? Last Saturday, 3 days ago, 3 days ago, and... Yesterday, ok? Is it clear? Ok, eso es lo que tenés que hacer en tu cuadernito, lo que practicamos oral y lo que practicamos escrito. Atención, cuando practicamos oral, no quiere decir que vos tenés que estar callado, mudo, no. Vos tenés que usar este mismo cuadro, este mismo cuadro, y hacer preguntas en tu casa. Por eso te lo dejo ahí y no salgo yo. Entonces, la question va a ser, vas a ser, where was... Entonces lo proyectas en tu televisor o en tu teléfono, pones pausa y where, where was uh, Ethan at 10 o'clock yesterday? He was at the clothes shop. Where was Ethan? Seguí todo acá ya, eh? At 10 o'clock last Saturday, he was at the train station. Where was Ethan at 3 o'clock three days ago? He was at the car park. Where was Ethan at 3 o'clock last Saturday? He was at the park. Where was Ethan? Ethan at 7 o'clock yesterday? He was at the theater. Yes? Así. Y después cuando terminaste de Ahmed, te vas a ir a la parte escrita. Porque en esto, lo que se practica en communication activities es oral and written. Oral para fijar la parte oral. Y escrito para fijar la parte escrita. ¿Dice clear? Where was Hamed three days ago? Three days ago, he was at the bus stop. Where was Hamed at three o'clock? He was at Granny's house three days ago. Where was Ahmed last Saturday? He was at the park. Where was Hamed at seven o'clock? He was at the theater. And bye-bye. Y se termina todo. Yes? The homework. Vamos a hacer, eso sería, así que lo tenés que hacer en tu cuadernito. ¿Yes? ¿Is it clear? Right. Good. No se te ocurra hacer en el libro, porque en el libro te queda poco espacio. Entonces, pone unidad 6, página 125 y haces las questions. 5 questions para Anance para Ethan and 5 questions Anance para Hamed. ¿Yes? Explico tareas con web 138, 138. 139. ¿Yes? Ok. ¿Qué vamos a hacer en la tarea? Follow the maze. Seguir. Vas a necesitar 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 colores. Y vas a seguir con cada color. ¿A dónde te lleva? ¿A qué persona te lleva ese camino? 
Después vas a unir, tapo porque ahí tengo yo mi respuesta, vas a unir y vas a, a ver, Mónica es el de, el caminito de Mónica. Entonces, voy a escribir una frase con Mónica que va a ser la siguiente. Mónica is going to study at university. Suponete que eh, me da acá cualquiera. Tom and Sam. Tom and Sam are going to play with the computer. Suponete que me dio con este caminito. Entonces, atención con... Completamos las frases después ahí abajo. Yes, el ejercicio 3. Atención con el futuro. Yes, entonces en este ejercicio yo tengo que poner fulanito, Mónica, is going to, going to, más el verbo, study, go, play, ¿está? No puedo poner is Playing. Is going to play. Si dice Tom and Sam, ¿qué voy a poner? Is o are? Are going to más el verbo que quiera. ¿Está? Pero el going to, repasando aquí en esta actividad, se forma con el sujeto más am, are o is, are en este caso porque es Tom and Sam, más going to más el verbo, ¿está? Así que enfatizo eso para que no hagas macanita. Y después, en, el, en la página 139, ¿qué tenemos que hacer? Questions. Yes. Ok. What are you going to do next holiday? Te da la pista y vos tenés que armar la pregunta. Yes. Oh. Are you going to go climbing? Are you going to go to do paint, a painting course? Are you going to go sailing? Yes. Y después reescribir aquí. Yes. Están desordenadas y tenés que poner en el orden. Atención si es question, si es... Son todas questions, ¿ok? ¿Y se crea? Una cosa es, what are you going to do? ¿Qué vas a hacer? Where are you going to go? ¿A dónde vas a ir? Yes. Y otras son las yes, no question. Is she going to go sailing? Are you going to go camping? Yes. Are your mom and dad going to read a book? Is it clear? That was all for today. Yes, okay. Practicamos entonces oral and written unit 5. Can, más adverbio. Yes, y unit 6. Where was he or she? Yes, más she was at, más las horas, más un adverbio. Okay, mua, 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 mua. bye bye, see you next class.